BotX automates arc welding utilizing Universal Robot's UR10E collaborative robot arm. The new Cobot welder is now deployed at PMI, solving significant production challenges in the Wisconsin base weld shop. All labor is hard to find in Wisconsin, and um, welding is a very high skilled job that there's just not enough of them out there. We heard that Hyrobotics was working on a robotic welding system and we, we, we fell in love with it the day it hit the floor. The high robotics team came in, they unloaded the bot X and within two hours they had it set up and within a half hour I was running it and programming it and doing it all by myself. There's been a lot of business that's uh, come knocking on our door. In the past we've had to no quote because it's taken welding and we only have about seven welders. So getting some of these Bot X robots in here, we're able to set up cells and we can get a robot in here and ready to weld the parts before we even get the first order in the doors. We have been successful. POs are coming in the door. Right now we have enough quotes out there that would fill up enough room for 30 welders. That just means more Bot X robots in our building going forward. The Bot X system is built around the Universal Robots Collaborative Robot. It makes for a very powerful mix. The fact that we can allow our customers to kinematically train the robot by just moving it into a position that they want to teach it and using our mobile app to capture um, where that robot is in space takes advantage of Universal Robot's extremely open platform to control how that robot performs from the cloud. And their new E-Series has some unique capabilities in its built-in force torque sensor, which we heavily take advantage of to um, provide a better user experience. Hi Robotics came out with this awesome app. If I have any kinds of issues, I can message them and instantly get a, a reply back. And the problem was resolved within minutes. We got over about 50 programs saved on that one. And I'm able to swap between parts within a matter of 15 minutes. Anything from thin gauge material to quarter inch material, from a generator mount to just a little gusset. We have other large cell robots, which you have to uh, tool up with uh, fixtures. So for us to do these small runs, it wasn't cost efficient. It could take up to 16 weeks to have a fixture built. The Botex robot comes with clamping systems and everything you need, and it's just plug and play. There's no capital investment up front. You pay by the hour. The per hour charge is when it's actually welding, compared to what an employee would get for their hourly wage plus their, all their overhead costs, you're probably saving half of what you would pay a normal welder. And the quality of the welds is great. It really takes the guesswork out of making sure you lay the weld down in the right spot. We're able to certify the robot and the programmer. So if the programmer is certified to program that robot, then any employee can actually run the parts on the robot and it's a certified weld. With us bringing in the, 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 the robots to do the smaller parts, which we can concentrate on with larger weldments. In the past, those employees were tied up doing the small little parts, which might not give us as much um, profit per part. We selected the BotX robots due to the fact that they are the collaborative robots and you don't need a large guarding system around them. Our first go around with the higher BotX robots was putting two robots on some mechanical presses we run in the series together. We just didn't have enough people to man these presses. Parts are conveyed to the presses, the robot picks the part up, puts it in the press, press stamps it, robot takes it out, puts it on another conveyor, goes to the next station. The system is set up for the humans to, to work with the robot. So if, if a person walks up to them, it'll pause the robot, the, the, the operator can check the part, and then the minute they walk away, the robot just starts over from where it was sitting at. It's just stop, go, it, it works out great. It's a big hit for the younger generation who wants to be uh, into tech to be able to work and program robots. So it's helped us um, with getting into that younger generation of workers. It's a little win-win package.